Hello engineers, welcome back to Engineering Design Simplified. In this video series, I will be solving tough engineering mechanics problems. If you want to watch more videos like this, please subscribe to my channel and press that bell button so that you will be notified when I upload a new video. Today's problem is the indicated location of the center of mass of 1600 kg pickup truck is for the unladen condition. If a load whose center of mass is x equal to 400 millimeter behind the rear axle is added to the truck, determine the load mass ML for which the normal forces under the front and rear wheels are equal. In this problem given is a pickup truck and of weight 1600 kg and whose center of mass is located at this point G that is 1125 millimeter from this point A. Now a load of mass ML is added uh, at it uh, in, in the truck so the center of gravity of center of mass of this load is at a distance x from b that is from rear axle now we need to in this problem we need to find this load ml for uh, the reactions at b and a are equal let us see in the coming slides how to solve this problem first let us see forces and reactions so the mass of the truck uh, 1600 kg is acting at point G vertically downwards and the mass ML is acting at this point the distance is x equal to 400 millimeter from B acting vertically downwards. So, so reaction at A is RA acting vertically upwards and the reaction at B is RB that is also acting vertically upwards. So the distance from here to here is 1125 millimeter from here to here is 1675 millimeter from here to here is 400 millimeter. Now let us write sigma f y equal to 0. So these two uh, forces are acting vertically downwards, these two forces acting vertically upwards. So R A plus R B, so vertical forces we have taken positive. So R A plus R B minus 1600 into 9.81 minus M L into 9.81 equal to 0. So 9.81 is acceleration due to gravity. Now rearranging this equation, we will get RA plus RB equal to 1600 plus ML into 9.81. Let us call this equation 1. Now let us take moments about A. So RA won't create any moment about A. Uh, this force 1600 into 9.81 and ML into 9.81 will create clockwise moments about point A. And this reaction RB creates counterclockwise moment about point A. Now let us write moment equation sigma MA equal to 0. So 1600 into 9.81 that is force where mass into acceleration due to gravity that is force into this distance from A to this G is 11, uh, 1125 millimeter. So that is written here plus ML this mass into 9.81 into this distance 1125 plus 1675 plus 400. So that is written here minus so this RB creates counterclockwise moment. So we have taken negative. So RB into this distance 1125 plus 1675 that is written here RB into 1125 plus 1675. So that is equal to zero. After simplifying this equation, we will get finally RB equal to 6306.4 plus 11.21 into ML. Let us call that equation two. For RA equal to RB, the equation 1 will become 2RB equal to 15696 plus 9.81 ml. So from this we can write RB equal to 7848 plus 4.91 into ml. Let us call this equation 3. Now let us equate equation 2 and 3. So we, we will get 6306.4 plus 11.21 into ml equal to 7848 plus 4.91 ml. So from this we can write ml equal to 7848 minus 6306.4 uh, by 11.21 minus 4.91. So finally this uh, mass ml is equal to 244.7 kg. That's all for today's video. If you like this content, please like, share and subscribe. Thanks for watching.